technically, I immediately go to the size of the power plant, which is basically how do we take something um, and miniaturize it down the power plant's about this big, a couple of inches. How do we take something that big and create enough power, enough pressure to take that projectile and then to put it through a barrel that's this big and um, put it at a speed that will not only hurt, but it will break the, the, the projectile apart. It will create the cloud that we want. How, how do you do that? And so technically, I think that's what's different from everybody else, is that nobody else has figured out how to do that. Now, yeah, I know. Once our product goes out on the market, people are going to take it apart and they're going to look at it and they're going to see, oh, that's what they did. Or when somebody looks at our patents, uh, they're going to look at that and say, oh, that's how they did it. You know? and so we had to be very, very careful uh, not to be showing this, not to be talking about it until we had patent pendings in process. We had everything ready because we know that technically people are going to take this product apart and they're going to want to know what's in it and how it's going to work. Okay? But I'm beginning to understand that what really makes this product different and is my, bad, my key feature. As I watched as I watched my daughter take that and put it in her hand. And she says, wow, this is so different than I thought it was going to be. This feels good in my hand. I feel confident. Uh, I don't feel that I'm afraid of it. That's what's special. Is that we solved a problem that my daughter had. That's what makes it great.